hi guys and welcome back to my channel so let's get back to business shall we so before I start my video that you've seen already what it is about I'm going to say so please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and if you you know anticipate for another video or whatever and uh, don't forget to give thumbs up if you did enjoy or if you do enjoy my videos you know so today I'm talking about the one and only Okay, I don't know what's happening with my camera. Okay, that ah, is much better. So today we're talking about the one and only, very, 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 very anticipated for me anyway, uh, Morphe palette, the 3502, which I was really waiting for it. Everybody was raving about it. Everybody was saying that it's going to be amazing, that it has the same pigmentation, the same way that it applies as the Jaclyn Hill palette. And because I do have the Jaclyn Hill palette, I was really excited because, not that I don't like Morphe, it's just that Morphe eyeshadows are just, you know, they're good eyeshadows, it's just not the bomb. So, you know. Um, anyway, so, um, it came in a box like this and I really enjoy that their box is quite different than the rest of the boxes so um, yeah it came in a box like that I like that it says um, second nature um, and then on the back you have all the ingredients and that it's made in China so uh, what else was I gonna say yeah I like that it has a red in here and I'd like to have another package as well as the, you know, as the package, but it's not. And I'm going to show you what the package looks like. It looks like that. So it's like a, you know, basic Morphe package. Although they did change the logo because I have another Morphe palette and it just changed, it, it seems different to me. So probably they've just changed the palette a little bit the way it you know, they have their names, and on the back it says again that it's made in China, and it's a 12 month um, eyeshadows, and on the back it has the 3502, like, just so you know that it's the 3502, especially if you own all of them, you have to know. So, opening the palette, which is really hard, if you have nails, be careful, because I almost broke mine, and I was really pissed off. So, when you open it, it looks like this yeah so I'm going to take off this the film so on the film it has all the names okay of the eyeshadows which to be honest for me it's really annoying because I mean I will take that off I usually don't really use them anyway but I mean uh, you know it's it's just a struggle you know maybe next time Morphe you can I don't know at the map somewhere around here or put them over here I have no idea just you know this is really not really helpful so okay so when I see the palette the first thing of course that everybody and their mothers would notice is the two reds here I mean are you not dying for that all this line here is just screaming my name uh, all these colors here are more dark and they're more browns so um, we have a very neutral colors and then we have a few like the red you know that like it says it's second nature but it's basically earthy colors I'd say like the red the orange you know um, you have a few simmers as well as the mattes we have the black of course but I don't think it's really really black well, it looks black, but I don't know. I don't know. I didn't really try the black yet. Okay, it's black enough. It's black enough. Now, to be honest, guys, I'm not going to be doing swatches for you because, I mean, 25 colors. Honestly, I am good. I'm not that good, okay? So, um, and of course, what I'm wearing at the moment on my eyes is a combination of some of the nudes over here as a transition I put some of the brown, I put some of the orange and then I put the red because I was dying to use it and I just wanted to see if it applies perfectly well I'm just gonna swatch that for you because I know that red is just the bomb okay oh my god this red is everything and I know that my look today is very edgy 
it's not like an everyday look that you're gonna wake up and make up okay I know you can go to work like this but I am just dying for this red this red is just my favorite color at the moment and I'm gonna swatch to the red which I was quite disappointed I was expecting something better from the red but now I don't know if it's because it's simmer or not but it doesn't really apply as great as I thought it will so like I have it on my eyes today but it doesn't really like I had to go and apply two or three times to actually get the color that I needed anyway but I was dying for this red so I really really enjoy that red and then this orange over here I'm just gonna swatch that for you as well because that's a beautiful beautiful color there you go I mean indeed the pigmentation is it is a bit different than the rest of the Morphe palettes but I still think that they're a bit patchy if you don't use them properly and I'm going to be swatching as well this orange as well the shimmer because oh my god guys these two colors but now I don't know about the seamers I think they did something to the seamers and well that applies a bit better so yeah I think that is much better much much better yeah so um, it could be the red as as a color or something I don't know but uh, as a palette it's a neutral palette with a few colors and it's very different from the 35O um, because I already had the 35O and um, you can say that it's completely different I don't know why they named it 35O too maybe because um, I, I don't know, like they usually put 35O um, as orange or 35P as purple, but I don't know now to be honest, like it has only a few orange, like, and you know. But however, it's a palette that you can create loads of neutral looks, you can create some of these browns to have as an everyday look, you can put, you know, the red for something more, you know. Uh, amazing or if you're a daredevil or the orange as well it's really really nice if you want to create something and um, I do like the rest of the colors to do something like an everyday look or the browns if I want to do a night out to probably try the black and this color over here really really like it um, to be honest, the rest of them, I kind of have seen them already, I kind of had them already. I was just trying to see a few new colors that they added because everybody was raving about it and I just wanted to see if they are actually nice or not. So I did create my look today. I'm not going to show you a tutorial, but if you do, if you do want to see my the way I created the look, I will show you, I will, I will make a tutorial for you. So just, you have to put down below you know in the comments down below that you want a tutorial and um, so this actually this bag cost me $23 plus shipping so basically I got mine for 25 euro from Beauty Bay because for me to ship from from specifically to go and shop from the Morphe uh, from the US it's going to be the, the shipping is going to be ripping my money like I could give 25 euro for that palette and then another 30 euro just for the shipping. So yeah, um, no, that's why I was waiting, I was anticipating basically for Beauty Bay to give me that beauty and the minute it launched I just got my hands on it and uh, I really like Beauty Bay if you're living in Ireland or UK because it has free shipping after you know 20 or 25 euro so it is actually a pretty pretty awesome website you just go you I'm just gonna leave a link down below and you can go and check so overall I think it's a good palette if you don't have a neutral palette or if you don't have a Morphe palette I'd say that this is a really really nice palette to create some nice looks some neutral looks some everyday morning looks some uh, night out uh, looks so yeah guys that's it what do you guys think about the palette do you think it's worth it like if you have it did you play with the palette and let me know in the comments down below anyway what's your thoughts what's your ideas um, if you want me to make a tutorial with that a different tutorial or this tutorial please let me know in the comments down below and I will see you again on my next video bye